Well, Mark, you're wrapping up your trip, and uh, you had six and a half days of fishing. Tell us about what kind of equipment you were fishing this week. Well, uh, the reels is what, or what really impressed me. They're, they're a Abu Garcia Rebo Insure. Uh, it's a seven to one ratio. Uh, I'm familiar with the Revos. I've got about 17, 18. I've been home and use them exclusively on Gunnersville where I fish for, for largemouth. Uh, what impressed me the most was how well they, they held up uh, in spite of the sand and, you know, they're used every week by, you know, a variety. We work them hard, don't we? I you mean, do. these, these reels are going out every sets. day, six and a half days fishing. Yeah. And then get transferred right over to the next group with a little oil and a little maintenance and boom, they're back on the water. You and, know? Yeah, and they're easy to maintain. In fact, they got a little hatch there. You know, you can lubricate the drive and pinion, you know, which, which will uh, lubricate the pinion gear. What I was amazed about them, other than the... Well, there's so many things, but but especially, you know, they're lightweight. You can fish them all day, all week. The braking system, you know, has a, an infinite, virtually an infinite uh, amount of braking system, so you can adjust it based upon the skill of the angler, whether you're casting in the wind, the weight of the lure, the action of the rod, all those sorts of things. Quick, easy adjustment. Uh, the drag system is, is essential. and. Never once did I experience the drag sticking in any way. It was a smooth, easy, just the way you want it, uh, easy to get to. The handles are shaped. In fact, there's a there's a uh, prototype out. Uh, that yeah, we got the fish there. Uh, yeah, prototype. I got the fish yet. It's got these great big long handles with big knobs on it, but it's made out of a material that's, that doesn't add any weight. It doesn't cause the reel to to rotate and, and feel awkward in any way. It's easy to grab. Uh, you know, for those, some people don't like to, that tab, you know, it's got a round knob and you can, like, it's like a you handle of a You can find it. What I like you, about it, when you want to find it, you can find you it quick. find it without even looking at it, throw back, you can do that, you know, when you're throwing out and essentially keep that bait moving, when you're throwing out and doing the transfer, you don't really have to look, look for it. You know, he's there, you know, and it's easy to grab. It doesn't add any weight. There's really no adverse effect side effect to having the, the larger handle. It's, and uh, it's matched up to the rod really well. You know, when you're fishing six and a half days, that's a lot of fishing. A lot of fishing. For a lot of, you know, you got a lot of big fish mixed in there, mm -hmm. and uh, you just don't have the, uh, you're not as tired at the end of the week, you know, carrying all that weight. Yeah, you know? and, and I, these reels, you know, some of these reels, after, after you use them a long time, you, you know, you feel that grinding, and even though it probably performs just as well, but it feels like a cement mixer. These don't. They stay as smooth as when they came out of the box. 11 ball bearings, in fact, they even actually get smoother over time because they don't have the bushings, which will, you know, waller out and, and the, the, the dimensions will become, you know, will be affected, create some oscillation and all the things you don't want. Uh, they may feel good right out of the box, but the bearings, the ball, literally the ball bearings, I believe it has 11 in it. The ones I have at home have 11. I think, I think these do as well. Uh, actually, it will get smoother over time. Uh, the level wind is is positioned in such the worm gear on the level wind is positioned where it doesn't get uh, uh, debris, sand, etc. in it. And the star drag, the reason I went to a Revo, I used I don't want to knock it, you know, say anything negative about another manufacturer, but the reason I went to the Revo was because because of all the things I've said today. But the star drag has a flange over the main drive gear, which prevents rain and things going in there and messing up the drag system and, and causing it to stick. That's it's just it's just. The, the engineering and the design done on these reels, either those engineers are avid bass fisher them, fishermen themselves, or they listen very well. Or a combination <laughs> of both. Hey, I'm well, impressed. we really appreciate fish, fishing with uh, anglers in Amazons, and I uh, hope we've succeeded in your expectations on catching fish down here and across the board, guide, service, right. uh, food, accommodations. Well, you have in every regard, and the reels is just, the reels and the equipment is just a small part of it. It, it. This operation is first class. Billy and his team, that you know, they're not looking to nickel and dime you or anything like that. He's given me hats to wear, you know, things, and, and it's just. But well, once very again, generous. thanks for thanks for fishing with anglers in, Mark. Well, we appreciate it. it. it was experience for Thank you, man.